good. Knox County spring break is next week and the Tennessee Aquarium is ready for visitors. Emily DeVoe shows us what a day trip to the Chattanooga attraction would look like this year. Without even leaving the state, you can travel the world at the Tennessee Aquarium. This year, the Chattanooga attraction is giving out passports for people to collect stamps from the various continents featured in the animal exhibits. I know people have been feeling cooped up with COVID and a lot of restrictions there. So this is a great opportunity to come here and get to escape and travel the world all in one place and support a local institution as well while you do that, which is really important right now. Maggie Seip gets to feel the warm weather of Africa every day at her job as an animal care specialist with lemurs. Uh, we have our troop of five ringtail boys behind me. So their names are Gil, Skip, Yoda, Twix, and Rolo. Uh, they're all boys up here, so these guys are just munching on their breakfast lettuce behind me. And then we've also got our radiated tortoises down here. She says that the months when they were close to visitors were hard on the animals, who are used to seeing people walk through their home every day. The lemurs get a lot out of like watching different people come through and like that's enriching for them. And so it was just really sad not to be able to share them as much as we normally do. So it's very good to have people back and I'm very excited to welcome a lot of families for spring break. The aquarium requires visitors to wear a face mask, and they've been limiting the number of tickets they sell each day to make sure everyone stays spaced out. Especially on Saturdays and Sundays, tickets seem to go pretty fast, and we'd hate for you to drive all the way down here and not be able to get in. So if you just reserve those tickets online, that's going to be the best way to guarantee that. When families come to the aquarium, there's a special tortoise that she says people hope to see while they're visiting. Like, that's really cute to hear a little kid be like, that's turn up the tortoise. I feel like we really made a connection with them. She recently shared a video of Turnup doing a little dance move while getting a shower, something she says they do naturally in Madagascar. It doesn't rain a lot where they are. They're more from the dry southern part of Madagascar. And so when it does, it's probably an exciting thing for them. So they all just kind of stand up and they'll wiggle the, their butts in the in the rain like they want to make sure they get their whole shell. Even if you can't make a trip down in person, she says they're trying to share as much of the aquarium experience as they can online. So you can still feel a connection with the animals from your couch. I'm Emily DeVoe reporting.